Welcome back to Dish Nation. I have some fantastic news, or should I say, noticias fantasticas. Oh, your Espanol is muy mal. <laughs> Dr. Ana Polo is in studio <laughs> yeah. with us. How was that, huh? Oh, I, 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 I thought it was excellent. How, how would you rule on that? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Believe it or not, he oh. did it pretty good. Oh. 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 Muy bueno. Muy bueno. Muy bueno is very yeah. good. Now, if you're not familiar with Dr. Ana Polo, she has a show on Telemundo uh, called uh, oh, boy. Casa, oh, boy. Oh, Casa oh, Serrano. That's right. Case closed. Case you closed. Got it. The show is such a huge success. You got a primetime edition of it as well. And now you have a new show. Yes. What's this new show called? Ana Polo Rules. Oh, how's so, it different from the other show? How's it different? Well, it, it's, it's different. It's not in Espanol. Oh. That's it. Yes. That's a good one. Yes. It's not in Espanol. <laughs> But it's me. It's my brand. It's my idea of, of justice with a human touch. What was so important that you jeopardized your relationship with your stepbrother? Um, court shows are so formal, right? They're so mysterious and so terrifying. The judge is wearing the robe and the courtroom is dark and the desk. I've always thought that the law has to be something... It's an everyday thing, you know? Everybody has to be familiar with it, not afraid. It's a tool we use to resolve conflict. So I take the mystery out of the law, and I concentrate on the human behavior that created the conflict. Because at the end, that's what I want people to learn. I want them to learn how not to create conflict and how to deal with it if it's because of circumstances. Okay. Does anything surprise you now? A lot of cases dealing with technology surprise me. Uh, the messes people get into when they use applications like mm. Tinder and... Uh, oh, Tinder. Right. You might want to... You know, yeah, stuff yeah. like that. Uh, <laughs> they, it surprises me a lot. Dr. Anna, I have a question for you. Are you ever surprised or have you ever kicked anybody out of your room for showing up... Um, to court, essentially, in like a wrinkly T-shirt. Like you go, seriously, that's how you think is appropriate to come? Yes. I've actually had uh, people go in, in the studio in my set, like they're dressing up to to go to a disco at night. <laughs> the little shorty dresses. The little short dress and the, you know, the chichis up here. <laughs> and uh, really sexy. And I say, do you think this is appropriate? Right. I would almost say, like, tell them, tell them, pretend you're going to church. But here in Southern California, people go to church, they don't dress up. That's so, right. so you're that's like, not, I don't no, even know that's what why I don't, That's why I don't even tell them, pretend you're going to church. <laughs> pretend you're going to court. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll tell you something. Judges look at how you're dressed and how you came to court that day. And that is part of the judgment. And they're claiming to be so downtrodden and they need mm -hmm. money, but they have a very nice watch on you. Yeah. Exactly. Oh. Exactly. Mm -hmm. gotcha. you. Many child support cases I've dealt with like that. <laughs> I have no money. Hey, you have a watch. <laughs> yeah. 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 What are you wearing? <laughs> Let me see it. Yeah. I'm going to keep it. <laughs> you owe $10,000 in child support. We're going to sell it. <laughs> That's why we love Dr. Yeah. Anna Polo. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming in. Be sure to catch Anna Polo Rules on Fox weekdays or check your local listings to find out where it is. We love you. Thank you.